Hi there, it's Claire Gilchrist here and we are talking Mental Made Easy. And today, the first in a series of five, for now, short weekly chats about treating bipolar or ADHD and more, called Insights. Now these are insights from my trademark therapy called Frequency Balance or the Gilchrist Method, specifically developed to help you understand, manage and even conquer these disorders. Based on extensive evidence-based research done over quite a number of years. Now current treatment for bipolar or ADHD for example consists mainly of pharmaceutical meds and in worst case scenarios only pharmaceutical meds. In good programs for bipolar anyway you'd be unpacking backed up trauma, dealing with symptoms, and possibly going for something like dialectical behavior therapy or DBT. If you've been diagnosed, you'll know what I'm talking about. But you may still feel unbalanced or stuck in a rut in your head, anxious, angry, frenetic, scattered, purposeless, flat, depressed, can't do anything, don't want to do anything. And don't you sometimes feel totally helpless or, or completely out of control because even though you're on your meds and you've done the therapy, it's this constant battle to keep yourself stable or motivated, productive, even happy. So here's an insight for you. Did you know that with bipolar or ADHD, for example, that your system just runs too fast. And yes, there are reasons for it, but it's a key aspect of both disorders, which are related, by the way. By slowing your system down, yes, even if you're depressed, with simple and practical tools, you can stabilize, you can be productive, you can start feeling purposeful and, yes, even happy. There is so much more we can do for disorders like bipolar, ADHD, etc. than is currently being done. The insight I revealed just now is fundamental in treating these issues and we're having great success in using the right methods to do it. I devised and trademarked the program called Frequency Balance, the Gilchrist Method, to help you understand and manage the symptoms, the behaviors, and the origins of bipolar, ADHD, etc. You know, in a matter of weeks, by having therapy and using unique tools and techniques in your own time, you can learn to self-manage your issues and unlock the amazing abilities you have that run alongside the problematic aspects. You may not have realized just how brilliant you actually are. I personally feel that at this point in time, we owe it to ourselves to innovate the ways in which we treat mental health problems. After all, just about everything else in our world upgrades at least uh, once a year. Real understanding and real solutions need to be where we're at now to help people find real help. Don't miss next week's insight.